Welcome back guys, thank you so much for all the love and support I got my very first video. Now, I said I wanted to use this channel so that I could story tell, and man, this week has been a roller coaster and I'm gonna bring you along. However, last weekend the UK put in a 14 day isolation rule for all travelers. I can't afford to do that in a hotel or Airbnb, so we have made the decision to find an apartment that we can live in afterwards as well. Okay, first I should clarify that whenever I say we in that last video, I am meaning me and my boyfriend. I also should clarify that the UK government hasn't actually implemented that rule yet. They've just announced that they're thinking about it. They're pondering on the idea of making travelers isolate for 14 days, so Shout out to you, Boris. I'll just uh, make about 10 different backup plans, just in case. So I was on the phone with my boyfriend. We were emailing the new landlord, talking about different things, and I get a text. Aaron, I just got off the phone with the COVID-19 hotline. I'm now isolated in my room. I will get tested for COVID-19 tomorrow. So now I don't know if I'm allowed in the UK. <laughs> So now, on top of the original backup plans that I was making, I now have to make more backup plans which involve staying in Canada because my mom might have COVID. We basically did everything we could to keep our family safe. I took that morning and I disinfected every handle, surface area, knob that she could have touched in the house. And then my dad blew up an air mattress so that he had somewhere to sleep for the next couple of nights while we waited for the results. I wasn't messing around. Mom got tested this morning. She got up really early, drove herself to her appointment. So now her car is in isolation as well. We are waiting for the results. The results will be in on Monday, hopefully, maybe Tuesday. It is what it is. That's how life is. On Saturday, dad and I basically went about our normal days. We split the tasks that mom likes to do on the weekends. And although it was a beautiful sunny day and she couldn't go outside and enjoy it, we did try and entertain her as much as possible. Then, Sunday rolled around. This morning when I woke up, I could hear my mom's voice upstairs in the living room and I immediately got out of bed, got dressed and stormed right up the stairs, prepared to yell at her. But her results came back this morning and she's negative. <laughs> She's negative and I'm going to the UK in four days. Oh, this week has been so stressful. I do still have to organize a place to stay, but before I do that, I should probably find out if they're gonna implement this 14 day rule. But I should probably start packing. Yeah, I'm gonna start packing. See you next week.